Clear the termite den. Grounded into the wood 0.12 update adds to the backyard the termite den. A wood pile full of termites, mosquitoes, spiders, milk molders and other goodies. If you follow all steps of this guide, by the end of it you will have collected one burgle chip, two mega milk molders, two milk molders, one scab and killed the termite game. To keep the tutorial faithful to the challenge and to help players that run into the termite den first thing, I will gear up only with items prior the Into the Wood update. Except for one tool. My setup is Ladybug Armor Set, Black Ant Shield, Salt Morningstar Level 7, Fiber Bandages, and the Termite Axe. If you need help crafting the Termite Axe, a guide is being suggested on the top right corner of the screen, and a link has been added to the video description. For mutations, I got Buff Lungs, Coupe de Grasse, Cardio Fan, Meat Shield, and Barbarian. There are five holes, entrances, into the Termite Den, but not all of them are useful. Let's check them out. Hole number one, number two, number three, number four, and number five. We can't see the hole number five on the screen because it is on the top of the wood pile. But don't worry, when we finish clearing the Termite Den, that will be our way out. Hole number 3 is the easiest way to go into the den and leads you to hole number 2. In other words, just a tunnel full of termites. We can avoid that. Hole number 4 is a long path to the main hall of the termite den. We can avoid that. Hole number 1 is a shorter path to the main hall, and that's the one we're gonna take. Remember to save your game, as this path is the quickest one, but not that safe. When you reach hole 1, the best way to go in it is by climbing to the top of the wood and jumping down. This entrance to the right leads you to hole number 4. There are two ways to deal with the termites. Kill them all. Or run away as they won't chase you for long distances. I will do a bit of both and you can see what best fits your gameplay style. Going straight forward will take us to the Termite Den main hall. At the main hall there are four tunnels. The one behind us, the one to the right is our way out through hole 5, the one to the left 
will lead us to some goodies. And straight forward across the hall is the entrance to the Termite King's Chambers. To keep it simple, we will clear all entrances going clockwise. Here we will collect a scab and on the other side a milk molar. These splinters blocking the entrance are the reason we need the Termite Axe. It can only be chopped by a Tier 3 Axe. The Termite King is not a hard insect to kill. I won't even classify it as a mini boss. But for first timers I do recommend trying to clear the area before fighting it. The king is dead. But this king responds every two or three backyard days. Come and kill it again. Feels good to kill a king. Here you will find a mega milk molar and the wood pile burgle chip. Now let's go back to the main hall and exit through hole 5.
On top of the wood pile, there are a bunch of goodies to collect. To make the guide shorter, I am just focusing on the milk molars. Mega milk molar here. And a last milk molar here. If you keep exploring the wood pile, you will find some more raw science, but that I'll leave it to you. GG, termite den 100% complete. If you have any questions about the termite den or anything else around it, leave a comment below and I will help you. Don't forget to subscribe to Spy as more content on the Grounded 0.12 update is coming. Also, consider being a member of the channel and unlock exclusive perks. Be part of the Spy Academy. It's okay, I'll let you spy on me.